Alright guys, this is a real quick installation video for people who need the visual reference help. Alright, I'm assuming you know how to get to the Realistic Lighting Overhaul mod main page. From here, you're going to want to make sure that you download um, both these guys right here. And then once you do, should be pretty quick downloads, you shouldn't have to worry about it. Obviously, internet speeds vary. You're going to want to go into your downloads folder. And for, uh, next, you're going to want to open up your Skyrim directory. Now I have a quick shortcut, uh, but that's, you know, different. You uh, want to find your directory for your Skyrim Special Edition, which would be in your Steam Apps Common. Um, so you go there, make sure you're in the right spot. You get your Skyrim Special Edition EXE. From there, open up your data folder. Open up the 40801 first. And then you're going to want to download your core files. You want to make sure you get all these core files. Drag, drop. I already have them in there, so it's asking me to replace. That's simple. Then you want to go to Optionals. Um, these are obviously, as it says, these are optionals. You don't have to have them in there. But it's a good habit to go ahead and put them in there, just in case later you do need them, because a lot of people are having problems with really dark nights. Um, this gives you the option. So once you do that, you're going to want to close these out. This is uh, just for documentation. gives you a readme and a change log if you're interested. And then next, you're going to 40802. Go ahead and open that. You want to get your core files first. Drag, drop. Um, now at this point, you should get this prompt too, because these are just update files of the previous ones you put in there. All right. And then you want to go to your Don Guard. Drop those in there. And then your weathers. And drop that in there. Should be good to go. Once you do that, close out. Open up your Nexus Mod Manager. And then from here, I already have them uh, activated. But you should, uh, inside your plugins, have the realistic lighting overhauls to activate. They won't be in a nice fancy order like I have them here. They'll most likely be down here at the bottom. Um, but what you need to do after you do that is come into the Realistic Lighting Overhaul main page, head over to Posts, and then the Sydney had gave you a nice little how to install. Um, down here, it shows you the mod order you need to load them in. So you come into here and you can cross reference. Um, the load order that they have right there with the load order inside your Nexus Mod Manager. And then after that, you are good to go.